Good morning, Kentucky. I'm Sarah Cardona. Derby week continues as we get, get closer and closer to the 149th running of the Kentucky Derby. And Forte is the favorite to win, but as we learned last year, anything can happen. Last year's Derby had the fastest splits ever recorded in Derby history. With the early leader, Summer is tomorrow running the first quarter mile in 21.78 seconds. The fast pace opened up an opportunity for anyone to win, and then Rich Strike happened. And this year, trainer Brad Cox has four horses in the race, including Angel of Empire sitting in post 14 next to Forte. Cox explained that he wouldn't be surprised if there was another burner of a race this year. I'm happy with it. Um, you know, break Flavian will put him in a great spot. He always does and excited about giving him an opportunity Saturday. He's a good horse. On paper, it doesn't, doesn't look like it's going to be real fast, but I know that the horses get revved up. It's a big crowd. It's a loud crowd. The jocks get revved up and they seem to go fast early and I don't think you're going to see much difference. And on the diamond, two in-state foes squared off against each other. EKU gets a nice road win against a good Northern Kentucky team. 10-7 was the final. The Colonel's Ron Franklin comes up big in the eighth inning, breaking the tie with a three-run jack, and that turns out to be the difference. EKU's record is a few games below 500 at 21-24. and and in the NBA, the Heat without Jimmy Butler against the Knicks. And we jump to the third quarter. Bam Adebayo fakes the handoff and slams it home, giving the Heat a four-point lead. And former cat Julius Randle showing off the playmaking skills, drive and dish to Mitchell Robinson. Bam setting up the offense. And Lowry oops Bam up, and he takes flight. Bam finished the game with four, 15 points. And Nick's looking to answer. Randall, ISO fadeaway jumper is cash. He had 25 points in his return. And then late in the fourth, tied game and not anymore. Jalen Brunson knocks down the triple. And the Knicks take game two, 111 to 105. And the series is even at one. The Heat just can't get healthy. I know. No, they can't. Everyone's injured right now. No. Tyler Hero, Victor Oladipo, Jimmy Butler. Mm. Yeah, yikes. Goodness. Wrong time for that to happen. <laughs> I know. Yeah. yeah. Ugh. And that's how it always goes. 625, stay with us. Your local news headlines are coming up. Plus, we're talking about the forecast as we inch closer to the Derby this coming Saturday. We're going to check in with you. Stay with us. You're watching Good Morning Kentucky.